Okay. Who's timing? Oh, uh, you time yourself. Oh, okay, so we're two tastes with the toes line. Oh. Okay. Now, one day at home, your toilet breaks down. Probably was because someone flushed a toilet rag down, but we're not looking at that right now. So you call the plumber out, and the plumber walks up, looks at the toilet, yes, looks at it, says, "Yep, that's a backup toilet." Walks outside, grabs his ladder, climbs up on your roof, rips up all the tiles, and then removes your entire house. <laughs> it's just what you asked him to do. No, you called him because your toilet was broken. <laughs> and so in this speech, I'm going to be looking at, is the affirmative team's plan actually topical? <laughs> are, they actually t are they actually dealing with the subject we've been given? Now, the standard I'm going to provide is that they have to deal with the laws that are already provided within the current status quo. And there are two, the main law that ethanol is found under is the Energy and Security Act of 2005. And what happened under this is ethanol subsidies and ethanol requirements were established and that this forces people to make ethanol and, and a certain amount and that by removing this you're removing an energy policy rather than an environmental policy now the impact of this why it's bad is because the affirmative has just re-roofed your house instead of fixing the toilet you as the judge were supposed to come here and vote on environmental policy not on energy policy clearly ethanol was un established under an energy policy this is sort of like your judge at an apple pie contest. <laughs> and you're making a pie. No, you're not making a pie. Someone else already did. But you find a peach pie there. Can you say that peach pie is the best apple pie? Not unless you can't taste anything. No. You literally cannot vote for it because you were supposed to vote for an apple pie, not a peach pie. Which means that this is out of your jurisdiction. This is out of the realm of where you can vote. The same thing occurs with the affirmative plan. Because they deal with an energy policy instead of an environmental policy, they're out of the regulations, they're out of the restrictions that you have to deal within when voting for the plan. So because the affirmative plan is not topical, you cannot eat the peach pie. Mm. <laughs>